Okay, so who knew there was an app for that? This Space Desk app installs a Windows driver on your Windows 10 PC so that you can use your Android tablet as a second monitor. Let's check it out. Who knew there was an app for that? This Space Desk app actually is a server component that you install on your Windows 10 desktop that turns your Android tablet into a second monitor. Now obviously if you're looking at a 4K output you're not going to get that here. But let's check it out. I want to see how this works. So they say to install the Windows 10 portion go to spacedesk.net. That's what we're going to do. Download now. We'll get the Windows 10 64 bit. Save that file. And we run it. I cropped and compressed a lot of this, but we'll still go through the progress indicators here. Okay, so we've installed this Space Desk server on our Win 10 machine. Let's go ahead and launch it and see what we see here. Okay, so it describes the network for this workstation that we're on and we can see if there's any network connections to remotes again here you want to be on the same Wi-Fi network as the tablet that you want to use as an additional display on your Windows 10 machine so we're going to go over to our tablet now and install the software okay so here we are on our tablet we go to Play Store and we're going to Space Desk Let's give that a search here it is, yeah. One million downloads. Shows us the same stuff we saw on the other one. Let's go ahead and uh, give it an install here. See what happens. Okay, it's installed. Let's open it up. Let's see what we see from here. Okay, so it can only connect to Space Desk Windows driver tells you to download it. We've already done that, so I'm going to say, don't show me again. I'm going to say, OK. All right, so it's actually detected my desktop. So I'm going to go ahead and click OK on that. Connected display off. So there, now it's showing me <laughs> a mirror of my desktop. Looks like it's the second screen here. I'm going to go back to my Windows machine here. Okay, so right now it does appear that I do have an extended display on my tablet. It does seem a bit pokey. It's probably because I'm also casting this to be recorded on the AGP tech. So what I'm going to do is turn off the casting and see if we can make this better here. So I'm going to get rid of the screen cast now. I think that's going to fix things up. So yeah, you've got the screen capture running on this. This is the monitor for my computer. And you can see there, there's the Space Desk server showing that Android is attached. And let's come down here. And this is actually acting as a second monitor on my Windows 10 workstation. I'm moving my mouse over to the second window there. Yeah, you can kind of see the mouse moving around there. So this is an interesting gadget. I'm going to have to play with it some more and see how I can uh, optimize it. Because like I said, there is just a little lagging in the mouse motion, etc. But it did add it as a second monitor. And I'll demonstrate that in the settings here as well. Yeah, see, so it does detect it as a second monitor. There we go. Let me hit that button again, identify so you can see my tablet using the space desk is acting as a second monitor for my Windows 10 machine. So I just wanted you to know this is out here. You might give it a try. Hey, that was actually pretty, that's kicking along pretty good now. Was seeing some lag before on the mouse because I was actually screen casting the Android onto the AGP tech so I could record that directly. And you got a few of shots of that in this video. Yeah, let's take a look here. So when we look at the Space Desk interface on the Windows machine, you have this button here. You can turn 
space desk on and off. And you've got access to your display settings. And I'm going to hit off. There we go. Now it's disconnected once I hit off. Okay. So check out Space Desk. It's an interesting product. I'm going to try using it a little bit. It's like having a spare 10-inch monitor on my standing workstation. So maybe it'll give me a little more screen space. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to Shotoku Tech so little Jimmy can have legs, won't you? Thank you very much.